Item number SCP-506. Index Instant Growing Plants. Object class Safe. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-506 grows in a 3 meter by 3 meter patch of soil, kept watered and fertilized via an automatic system. The air of the room where SCP-506 is kept must be filtered to prevent release of SCP-506 seeds into the environment. Personnel entering the enclosure must wear biohazard suits composed of inorganic material and must be decontaminated upon leaving the area. Description SCP-506 is a genetically engineered variant of zucchini Cucurbita pepo created by the Corporation as a hardy and rapid growing food plant. SCP-506 exhibits several undesirable and dangerous qualities. 1. SCP-506 will attempt to grow on any organic material, including on living beings. The seeds germinate on contact. 2. SCP-506 grows extremely rapidly, reaching full size in 5 minutes or less. 3. Due to its rapid growth, SCP-506 drains its growing medium of nutrients at an accelerated rate. Nothing will grow in soil that has harbored SCP-506 plants without extensive nutrient replacement. 4. SCP-506 seeds are much smaller than typical squash seeds and disperse easily in the wind. SCP-506 is inedible as the seeds will get expunged if any are consumed. To the best of the knowledge of the Foundation, SCP-506 has not escaped into the wild and Corporation has destroyed all samples in their possession. Addendum SCP-506 is evolving rapidly as indicated by the incidents below. Incident Report 506-15-16-20 SCP-506 plants observed attempting to grow on the walls of the containment facility. Although the plants died of malnutrition, testing indicates that the latest generation requires 30% fewer nutrients than when originally contained. Research in progress to find materials that do not support SCP-506 growth. Incident Report 506-21-120 Dr. K found dead in the SCP-506 enclosure, covered with plant growth. The means by which his suit was compromised is unknown. SCP-506 roots have been found to secrete a powerful anesthetic, explaining why Dr. K did not sound the alarm or attempt to escape the area. Researchers must be under video surveillance while working with SCP-506, with another researcher ready to assist in case of accidental infestation. Reclassification as Euclid recommended.